Y'all, there's still drama going on between DDG and Ruby Rose. If y'all haven't watched my part one, please make sure y'all check it out. It's also going to be in the link below in this video. So y'all, so in my last video, there's a screenshot of DDG hitting up Ruby Rose. So Ruby Rose went on her Twitter and said this. Dudes hit me up on Twitter because they know they blocked on everything else. So DDG reposted this and said... Cap, you old news gang, you want to be Ice Spice now. That he put a clown face emoji as you see. This is the most relevant you've been in years. Quit posting that weak music. You didn't write your own story. So, my question is, why is DDG reposting Ruby Rose tweets and responding to it? You know, like, does he feel a little guilty or is he doing this because, you know, because when Ruby Rose tweeted, tweeted that, you know, people hit me up on Twitter because they know they're blocking everything else. She never really mentioned DGG, so he could have just ignored that. But right now, he's making himself look guilty because why are you doing all of this? He can just easily ignore it if it's not true or unless it's true and he feels like he needs to prove himself. I don't know. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. But let's move on. So Ruby Rose went on Twitter and said, all boys are the same. Hmm. Let me know how y'all feel about this. Do y'all think all dudes are the same? Let me know in the comment section below. Let's move on. So I'm just going to give my quick opinion on this whole situation. First of all, you know, I feel like Holly Bailey does not deserve this. Like, this is too much. Like, Holly, she's doing big things. She's about to be the first Black Little Mermaid. Like, her Little Mermaid movie is coming out really soon. She don't need all this negativity. And not only that, but Holly is very smart and intelligent and y'all like she don't need all this toxic things in her life no one deserves this toxic things in her life you know not only that but y'all in a few days is gonna be valentine's day all this drama for what and if y'all watch my part one video ddg did dm ruby rose and she took a screenshot of the message and the message proof it was ddg because it had his name on the message y'all and basically rubriel said that ddg dm her the same day he got into an argument with holly bailey and i feel like that's just really just messy right there like why are you dming your ex when you have an argument with your girlfriend like what is that like what kind of game is he playing but let's just say allegedly because you know we're not 100 percent sure and y'all, like, this is just, I don't know, like, this is too much. Like, Holly is too beautiful and smart for all of this. Like, come on. She's Beyonce's artist. She has a big movie coming out soon. Like, come on, man. So, and then the fact that DGGs, like, keep responding to Ruby Rose messages. Like, Ruby Rose is d writing subs about DDG, but she didn't specifically say his name. Why is DDG constantly responding back to ruby rose and retweeting her messages like it's too much why are you giving your ex so much attention especially a few days before valentine's day like come on but in the comment section below please let me know how you feel about this whole situation i honestly feel like this is just very messy but let me know how you feel in the comment section below